Unit 5, Lesson 7. Using diagrams to represent multiplication. Number 1. Here is a rectangle that has been partitioned into four smaller rectangles. For each expression, choose a sub-rectangle whose area, in square units, matches the expression. A. 3 times 6 tenths matches sub-rectangle B. B. 4 tenths times 2 matches sub-rectangle C. C. 4 tenths times 6 tenths matches sub-rectangle A. D. 3 times 2 matches sub-rectangle D. Number 2. Here is an area diagram that represents 3 and 1 tenth times 1 and 4 tenths. A. Find the areas of subrectangles A and B. Subrectangle A is 3 and 1 tenth times 1, and that area is 3 and 1 tenth units squared. Subrectangle B, 4 tenths times 3 and 1 tenth. So the area for subrectangle B is 1 and 24 hundredths units squared. Number 2B. What is the area of the 3 and 1 tenth by 1 and 4 tenth rectangle? So I wrote it as a fraction, 3 and 1 tenth times 1 and 4 tenths. Then I wrote it as an improper fraction, 31 tenths times 14 tenths. And that gave me 434 hundredths, or 4 and 34 tenths. The area of the rectangle is 4 and 34 hundredths units squared. Number 3. Draw an area diagram to find 36 hundredths times 53 hundredths. Label and organize your work so that it can be followed by others. Here I drew an area diagram and I have a sub-rectangle A, which dimensions are 3 tenths times 5 tenths. Sub-rectangle B with dimensions 6 hundredths times 5 tenths. Sub-rectangle C with dimensions 3 tenths by 3 hundredths. And sub-rectangle D with dimensions 3 hundredths times 6 hundredths. Number 4. Find each product. Show your reasoning. A. 2 and 5 tenths times 1 and 4 tenths. I drew a diagram to represent this. I have four sub-rectangles, one of them measuring 2 by 1, the second one measuring 2 by 4 tenths, the third one measuring 5 tenths by 1, and the last one measuring 5 tenths by 4 tenths. In the work shown here, I figured out the product of a rectangle with the dimensions of 2 and 5 tenths multiplied by a rectangle with dimensions of 1 and 4 tenths. And in the work shown here, I found the area of all four sub-rectangles and I've added them together. And the area totals 3 and 5 tenths, so the product of 2 and 5 tenths and 1 and 4 tenths is 3 and 5 tenths. B. 64 hundredths times 81 hundredths. I created a diagram with four sub-rectangles. One sub-rectangle has dimensions of 6 tenths by 8 tenths. Another sub-rectangle has dimensions of 6 tenths by 1 hundredths. The third sub-rectangle has dimensions 4 hundredths by 8 tenths. And the fourth sub-rectangle has dimensions of four hundredths by one hundredths. The total area of all four sub-rectangles is 5,184 ten thousandths units squared, or the product of 64 hundredths and 81 hundredths is 5,184 ten thousandths. Number five. Complete the calculations so that each shows the correct sum or difference. 2 and 31 hundredths plus 7 and 64 hundredths equals 9 and 95 hundredths. 2 and 38 hundredths plus 6 and 64 hundredths 
equals 9 and 2 hundredths. 4 and 37 hundredths plus 2 and 15 hundredths equals 6 and 52 hundredths. 1 and 56 hundredths plus 38 hundredths equals 1 and 94 hundredths. Number 6. Diego bought 12 mini muffins for $4.20. A. At this rate, how much would Diego pay for 4 mini muffins? Well, we know that Diego bought 12 mini muffins for $4.20. So I can divide 12 by 3 to get 4 mini muffins. And if I do that, I have to divide $4.20 by 3, and that gives me $1.40. At this rate, Diego would pay $1.40 for four mini muffins. B. How many mini muffins could Diego buy with $3? Explain or show your reasoning. If you get stuck, consider using the table. 12 divided by 3 equals 4. 4 divided by 2 equals 2. 2 divided by 2 equals 1. And I have to do the same thing to the column on the right with the price. $4.20 divided by 3 equals $1.40. $1.40 divided by 2 equals 70 cents. And 70 cents divided by 2 equals 35 cents. At this rate, 8 muffins would cost $2.80. And 9 muffins would cost $3.15. $3.15 is too much, so the most mini muffins Diego could buy at this rate would be 8 for $2.80. Congratulations! You have completed Unit 5 Lesson 7 using diagrams to represent multiplication. Music